Hello all my Kinveens, Papa Ken today bringing you a video in which I will most likely not be on camera. But yesterday I got this package from Amazon, and some of you might know what it is, but I figured, hey, I haven't, like the last unboxing video I did was actually the, um, when I got this camera that I'm recording with, so I figured I would do another one. And this won't be super long or anything, I'm not going to go into huge detail because I know those can get really long and quite boring. But, for those of you that might not know what's in here, you might get a glimpse. What could that be? Oh my god, it's The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD. Lots of reflection from the lights on that thing, so it's hard to see. But yes, I pre-ordered the version that came with the Amiibo. As you can see, the Midna and Wolf Link, Ami Wolf Link Amiibo. And... Yeah, I just, I really wanted to share this with y'all because I am, I, I've been really excited since this was announced. Now, the Majora's Mask uh, HD remake was announced, and I know a lot of people that got really excited about that, and that's awesome, but I never played the original Majora's Mask, and after playing the remake, I'm, I like it, but I'm not a huge fan. But Twilight Princess is one that I definitely do enjoy, and oh my goodness, the... I love the artwork for this. I apologize for the reflection. I'll try and fix that in my editor. But, like, the quality on this thing is amazing. And it might not show very well through the packaging. But actually, you know what? I'm not one that, like, yes, I do collect Amiibos to an extent. But I'm not one of those that, you know, you have to keep it in the box to retain its value. No, it's an Amiibo. It's a toy. You take it out so you can place it. I, I, I don't agree with people that decide not to take things out of packaging. I just think, think that's kind of ridiculous. Ooh, and I love the little detail here. They have the, um, the uh, Legend of Zelda symbol, or at least one of the symbols there at the base. And I really do hope that the details of this thing pick up in the camera because I just I love the way that they've constructed Wolf Link. Just like the individual hairs, it's so nice and textured. And Midna looks friggin' adorable. Oh, apologies there. It's kind of hard to <laughs> keep it centered while I'm holding it like that. But my goodness, I just, I absolutely love this thing. And I love the little detail of how it goes from the solid color to the uh, more transparent orange there at the end of her hair, which it kind of becomes a fist, which, ah, I just, I love it so much. It's so cool. So yeah, that one's definitely going to be getting used, not only in the game, but it's going to be going up with the rest of my collection, for sure. And I'm sorry for any of the collectors that I made cry by opening this, but like I said, I don't like keeping them in the boxes. I think that's a waste of a good product, personally. And then, of course, we have here The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess in HD. It's rather light. I'm trying to... I can't really remember whether or not... Um, the original Twilight Princess came with a instruction manual or not, but based on the lightness, I'm going to assume that it didn't, or rather that this one didn't, which is unfortunate because I, I, I always really like the, uh, if, if they put work into the instruction manual, the art that they'll usually put in those, but of course that's not so common a thing anymore, and I guess it saves the money. Yep, all we got in here is a... Uh, basic viewing electronic manual so nothing of any real importance there I'll probably actually throw it away after this but here we have the disc and at this point that's all there really is to show but again just like I love the artwork it's very nice and just to let you all know I am actually going to be attempting to live stream this, or at least the first little bit of me playing on Twitch. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> so I'm going to give that a shot, hopefully as early as this weekend. I'm going to try and get this up on Saturday. So possibly as early as Sunday, I'm going to try and live stream this with the new equipment I have. Fingers crossed that'll work out. And um, I, I mean, the channel is not big, obviously, but if you want to check it out, if you'd want to follow me on Twitch, it's um, uh, twitch.tv slash Media, you know, just like my name here on YouTube and most other places. 
but yeah, if you're interested in that at all, if I'm able to get a time solidified, I will post that, and I will, of course, uh, share a quick little video on YouTube before the live stream goes live, so you can go check that out. So yeah, thank you all very much for joining me for this short little opening video. Uh, I know I I know I've been really excited for this, especially the Amiibo toy, but I cannot wait to get into this game because it's one of my favorite games for the Wii when it came out. It was one of the earlier titles, but honestly, it's still one of my absolute favorites, and I'm interested to see how it looks, um, you know, in the HD remake. I'm, I'm really excited to check this out, so I'll end this here because I'm starting to ramble. Everyone, thank you very much for joining me for this opening video. I hope you liked it, uh, and until next time... I'm Papa Ken, and I will see you in the next video. This is really awkward to aim my finger. <laughs> anyway, bye everyone.